I've known Dwayne and Dwight for 52 years. I've had that pleasure because they are the most amazing and wonderful brothers on the planet. I have many stories about growing up in the household with musicians, um, Dwayne and Dwight playing under the tutelage of our father, Lloyd Arthur Smith, and so our house was always filled with music. I came here in the, in the uh, uh, late 60s, and we used to go to um, uh, uh, the park, and who would be there but this young talent, the Bosman twins, playing at 17 years old in the park. I'm sitting there just marveling and admiring uh, as being what the future looks like at jazz. So the Moose Lounge was just an incredible place, especially back in the, the 60s and, and, and the 70s. And so I do remember them from, from back in the day of, uh, of being there and being a, kind of the, of the, the cornerstone of, of what the Moose Lounge was all about. It was a formative uh, part of our early playing. A lot of musicians who would come into town would come in and play, uh, stop in and hear us at the Moose or sit in with us. It was a little hole in the wall in North St. Louis uh, where we actually booked our first European tour. You, you gotta understand, my, my, my mother is a really good critic. She's 87 years old. She played the saxophone herself. She also plays piano and she also sings, so she knows music. She absolutely uh, not only adores them, but has great admiration and respect for, for their craft. Well, I'll tell you what, whenever they play here at, uh, at the Faring Jazz Bistro here at the Harold and Dorothy Stewart Center for Jazz, they always sell the house out. They always have standing ovations. Since I'm a jazz pianist, at some stage, there's going to be an intersection. <laughs> and uh, certainly, uh, they came to the campus to perform, I think, during my first year in the Pilot House, which is down in the basement of our Millennium Student Center. And uh, at some point, someone said, you get up and play as well. So I got up there and jammed with them, did a blues and did some other numbers. Well, first of all, they're superb musicians. And the fact that they're superb musicians, everyone looks up to them. And they also believe in educating students. So they're involved in all aspects of K through 12, either professionally or simply volunteering. Improvisation in jazz comes in many forms. So all you need is some kind of idea with any kind of music that you have, an idea or a statement, and then you evolve around the statement as an example. And I might say, skit, should have a do vip. We are so honored to receive this award from the Arts and Education. We want to thank God most definitely first. And we want to thank our families friends and loved ones. I like to thank my, my uh, wife and my family, my son and my daughter. We thank, want to thank St. Louis, all the fans and all the um, new fans that we will garner as a result of this.